It's been a long time since we've had any big update on Captain America 4. It was over a year ago now at this point when this film was first announced. It was the same day as the finale of The Falcon and the Soldier where we got the reveal of, hey, Anthony Mackie is coming back and he's going to do Captain America 4. And that was something super exciting because I love The Falcon and the Soldier. I love Anthony Mackie as Sam Wilson as Captain America. And I'm excited to see this character's future, specifically now that he's coming back to the movies. And I've always loved the Captain America side of things in the MCU, especially like Captain America villains with like Red Skull and Baron. And Zemo and Artem Zola and now US agent and that's something I've always loved and now getting to see this new version of Captain America is something I'm even more excited to see. Now today we do kind of have an update on this film. It is coming out from 4chan which of course is always a gamble when it comes to that because it could be somebody just making stuff up on there or it could be an actual person with insider info leaking information to us through 4chan anonymously. So we're going to go and check this out and basically it's small details about some of the characters that will be appearing in Captain America 4. So obviously Anthony Mackie as Sam Wilson, aka Captain America. This is one that obviously we already knew about. Another one that was kind of assumed is that Sebastian Stan will be back as Bucky Barnes, aka the Winter Soldier. This is another one I'm excited for, especially seeing him post the Falcon Winter Soldier, what he's going to be now, because he's not really the Winter Soldier anymore. Is he now the White Wolf again? Are we going to see him actually become the White Wolf from the comics, or, or is he just going to be... Bucky Barnes like I, I don't really know but I'm definitely excited to see more of this character in the MCU because he's always been one of my favorites he's got such a tragic story but this is where we get interesting because we're also going to have Danny Ramirez as Joaquin Torres aka the Falcon this is a character that was briefly set up in the Falcon Winter Soldier you know he's in the first episode and he was in a couple other episodes throughout the season as well, and this was a character that got me really excited because before the Falcon Winter Soldier, I'd never heard of him, but once we saw him in that, that first episode, I did some research and I found out that, hey, in the comics, when Sam Wilson became Captain America, uh, Joaquin Torres became the new Falcon, and especially given that at the end of the Falcon Winter Soldier, Sam Wilson actually gave Joaquin the Falcon suit and like the wings, it made sense that they were setting up this future of walking Torres as Falcon in the MCU. So this is something I'm really excited to see, is to see this character come back, because I already loved him as a character in the Falcon Winter Soldier, but to see him actually suit up as the Falcon, especially if he has the same Falcon suit from the comics, because um, it's very different from the Sam Wilson Falcon suit. This one is more green and orange, and that's something I'm really excited to see uh, play out here, especially because now we got a Captain America, and... Now he needs his Falcon sidekick. I'm I'll I'll be interested to see also like what kind of role Bucky plays of like is he just a sidekick to Captain America or is it gonna be an equal billing type thing? I, I don't know, but I'm excited to see Falcon come back as well. This new Falcon, just like how we're getting a new Captain America. But what's most interesting is that this post mentions that Moon Knight is going to be appearing in this movie and they don't know what kind of role he's going to be playing or if this is going to be the next time we see Moon Knight, but Moon Knight will be a part of Captain America 4. Now, I don't think anyone saw this coming because obviously we knew Moon Knight was going to have a big future in the MCU. We knew that he was going to be coming to the movies at some point, but Captain America 4 what is he going to do in Captain America 4? I honestly do not know. I mean, it could be possibly some ties to Mark Spector's CIA past and his mercenary work. Um, I guess that could be somehow tied into it. But other than that, I don't really know how he's going to work within this movie. But I loved Moon Knight as a series. I loved Moon Knight as a character. So the more Moon Knight, the better, honestly. And to see a Moon Knight... Captain America team up or maybe even seeing them fight each other would be awesome and, and to see Moon Knight interact with other characters of the MCU I feel like Captain America is one that makes sense for Captain America to maybe be the first MCU character that Moon Knight meets I feel like that would be kind of cool to see especially seeing their interaction and stuff that could be pretty funny uh but guys what do you think about this possibility of seeing Moon Knight in Captain America 4 as well as also seeing Joaquin Torres come back as the new Falcon for this film and what else do you want to see from the MCU's Captain America 4? So guys, thanks so much for watching. Please drop a like if you enjoyed this video and hit the subscribe button so I can keep it to date on everything goes on in the Marvel life.